vlog. I am so excited. That is the start of the weekend and we've got a very, very exciting weekend planned indeed. Tomorrow's Esme's birthday sleepover. Oh my gosh, a little bit nervous to have lots of 10 year olds. In fact, not lots, there's only going to be four. Ten, but bear in mind guys, I've got four children myself <laughs> running around the house. I need to make sure I've got enough activities planned so that the girls don't get bored. We do have a surprise that Esme doesn't know about arriving tomorrow. That will hopefully keep them entertained for quite a while. And then we've got a few activities in mind, or I've got a few activities in mind that I need to go and get the items for today. So one of those things I'd like to do with them is a tie-dye t-shirts and maybe pillowcases. I went to a party last weekend one of our good friends and she did tie-dyeing and the girls loved it and so did everybody else that was at that party so I thought that might be a good idea oh no I thought about some crafts so we're going to go to hobby craft and get those look at you oh you've just pulled it down you just pulled it down what are you doing are you getting bored down there now hey Jace has just been sat here or laid here playing at the side of me. So yeah, I'm going to hopefully go to Hobbycraft with Jace this morning and go and get some supplies for some craft ideas that I have. And also, what was the other thing I just met? Oh, the tie-dye. Hopefully I'll be able to get some tie-dye kits from there. Also, Esme got some slime bits for her birthday that I got her from B&M. And it's these basically. So some glitter glue type things, a pink, a silver and a blue one. And then some of this um, activator or as it says on here, magical liquid. And then I also got her lots of these bowls so that she's got actual proper mixing bowls to make the slime in. But she mentioned this morning how she really wants to do that with all of her friends on her sleepover, make some slime. I mean, what set of 10 year olds doesn't want to make slime on a sleepover? But I don't know if there's enough there for all of the girls to make their own slime. So I'm going to go back to B&M and buy some more of these activators and glues. And I think that's everything. I think that everything I think with the tie-dye the craft the making the glue and then I've also got a baking type kit thing to do with them as well plus the surprise that I've got that's coming tomorrow and Esme will want to play with her new toys like her Barbies and things I think a few of the girls are bringing their rebond dolls etc etc they should hopefully be occupied enough Chris is out today he's doing some skate things he's setting off now it's just gone 10am and he won't be back till about 10am 10pm tonight so all day again riding solo with my rollo but thankfully the sun's shining it looks like a really nice day first things first these are what i was looking for for the girls to decorate i thought they could maybe paint them and then stick some bits and bats on them so i've got the letters now i need to go and get the decorations for them What's up bye fam? So as you know from Sarah, I am out today on a skate day and it's been a really, really good day so far. I've had a really, really good time. Although, I'm not gonna lie and say I haven't fallen and taken a few bruises. I have, definitely. My arm is actually killing. It's all good though, it's fine. But it's been a really, really good day. It's been a productive day and I've got loads of stuff done and I'm feeling really, really good. The weather is beautiful. Look at that blue sky. I'm so out of breath. I'm carrying literally a camel on my back full of video camera equipment blades food water you name it it's extremely heavy so i just finished up in where did we go hobbycraft just finished up in hobbycraft and the one thing that i didn't get because i wasn't sure if it was the right one or not is the ingredients for the sign i went and got them from bnm last week and i know that's definitely the correct ingredients i didn't want to mix ingredients just in case i don't know it messes up the slime or something because whenever I try to make slime, I've only ever done it twice before and it's been a massive fail. Yeah, and it was more expensive anyway in Hobbycraft. So I called 2 pm which I've just been to now, picked up the bits for that, and now I've just met up with Jane and we're going to have some lunch. We've gone for a toasty sandwich and a drink, which looks delicious. Jace has literally not slept today. <laughs> he slept for probably like 10 minutes or something like that after in the car and now he's awake again. So now that he's going to start getting fussy in a little bit. We're going to eat this up now. By the way, the weather is so nice today. It's really hot, isn't it? My body's not prepared for hot weather. Hello, cheeky chap. <laughs> Are you in a good mood despite not having no sleep for about five hours? <laughs> is that funny? Do you think it's funny? Do you think it's funny? 
<laughs> oh, is it funny? It's such a gorgeous day. I need to stock up on some water and some refreshments before we hit up the next spot, which I'm really excited about. It's my favorite spot ever. And I've been dreaming about some tricks that I want to get on here today. So fingers crossed, it's going to go really well and I'm going to nail them. I don't know if this is just me, comment below if you're the same, but Lidl reminds me of holiday because usually whenever we go away to like forest holidays or somewhere in the UK that we love to go to, there's always a Lidl nearby. And we usually go shopping at Lidl. So coming into a Lidl makes me think of holidays. There's not actually any Lidls near where we live, so it's a treat come out to where there's somewhere to where there is a little bit yeah like I said there isn't really many around where we live unless you take a drive out so we just arrived back home picking up three very happy munchkins on the way very happy because it's Friday! Who remembers that feeling when you were in school when it got to Friday at three o'clock obviously the girls finish later on a Friday my girls don't finish until four but at three o'clock on a Friday you just felt like you're on top of the world and then Sunday night at about six seven eight p.m. it was like the opposite feeling anyway we just got back home Isabel's upstairs cleaning out her bedroom because it's a mess our house lots of you guys always say or lots of people who come to our house always say your house is always so clean and tidy no it's not especially not Isabel's bedroom it's a typical 13 year old's bedroom and when we went in there today after she went to school I was just like this needs a good clean so she came in and she's helped herself to some wipes and surface cleaner and things like that and she's upstairs now sorting that out playing with Jace in the living room and Granny and Esme's upstairs. I think she's opening up some of her birthday presents. Hi guys! I just got back from school, so I've got my hat's a bit of a mess. I wear one of my birthday outfits and I'm literally so grateful for all these presents I got yesterday, including this. And yes, I am holding it upside down. But this is my phone. I don't think I even showed you the phone case. Okay, so this is my phone. But look how satisfying it is. <laughs> It's so satisfying. This is my phone case. The phone from the front is quite big, the phone case, in case I dropped it. The front, super duper cute, me and Jace. And I'm just obsessed. I am never stopped playing with it. I've never had a phone before and I'm just too excited. So anyway, I'm gonna set all my babies up and I'm about to open all of my four hair drawers that I got. I've got quite a lot of presents to open and I've only opened Barbie so far. So yeah, I'm gonna just start cracking and opening some presents. I can only be some kind of boy. Time to open the door here. Who's See? it gonna be? Oh, it's the one I wanted! <laughs> this is the girl that I wanted. This is the girl I was hoping Isla would get. She's really pretty. Oh my gosh, look at her hair! What? Oh, I love her dress. <gasps> she looks so pretty. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. Gosh, she's got a lot of friends there to hang with, right? <laughs> And we still got another couple more to open. Yeah, Three. Two. Okay, you open all those and then you can show the iPhone who you got. Hello everyone, I have just got back home from school and I haven't even got dressed yet because I've just been cleaning my bedroom because it was an absolute mess. I've just cleaned it all up now and you're probably thinking why have I got one earring in? Uh, the other one has fallen out, which is a real shame, but I'm just gonna keep this in on for, for a bit. Anyway, I've just finished cleaning up all my bedroom, getting everything nice and clean and making my bed and everything. Also, do you think this is cool, guys? I made my little person here. I had these, but I didn't really wanna put them in my drawer because I just don't have enough room. So I thought, why not make this top, this like coat thing into a skirt and then just put the like, jacket on top. Really nice. Anyway, I'm about to go into the bathroom now because I need to um, clean my bathroom as well. <laughs> So that took a lot of goes, a lot of hurt, <laughs> a lot of misses. I got it. I think that counts. I'm pleased with that. I'm happy with that. I did give it another 10 goes after that one just to see if I could get it just a bit longer on that second grind. It's so hard though. I'm just spent though. I'm like, literally, I must have done it. I've done it a lot of times. And I'm just spent. I've got no energy. So, um, so I'm going to call it a night. I'm happy with that clip. I did it. I did the trick. It's a really, really hard trick to do because you're not letting go of that one foot that you're holding. It's so hard to hop from one foot to the other without letting go of it. I didn't let go of it once. The only thing I struggled with was either 
switching to the trick just for the fear element because sliding that second trick is really hard to balance so you either slip out and like flip upside down or you stick and you don't slide and you don't lean into it enough and you stick and then you fall fall forward so it's really 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 tight to get anyway I'm absolutely done I'm so beat I need a bath I need some food I'm gonna head home and see the fam give Jace a massive cuddle and all the girls who's that handsome little boy who's that handsome little boy <laughs> Oh, he's looking so sleepy right now because he just woke up from a little, well, a little, not a big nap. He's been asleep about two hours. It seems like today's vlog's going to be very broken and choppy and like, what's going on? Because I feel like the footage has been just like filming random little bits. Anyway, the girls just got home from swimming about an hour ago and Esme has asked if I want to have a game of Connect Four. So we're going to have a game, aren't we? And Isla. Isabel's setting up some Barbie stuff. Isabel's setting up some Barbie stuff because they're going to all go and play Barbie dolls afterwards. So Isabel's Mommy. unboxing that right now. And me and Esme Mommy. are about to have a game of Connect oh. Four. Ooh. I can't get that one in. <laughs> okay, what colour do you want to be, Es? I'll be yellow. Okay, and I'll be red. Nice. Like a heart. Like a love heart. Yes. Okay, do you remember how to play? Do you remember how to play? This is the cheap Excel. version of Connect Four, by the way. This was like five pound or five pound ninety nine. Yeah. I'm from Smith's Toys. It's not the official. I can't remember what the official name is, but it's not the official one. Like this is called Line Up Four, um, but it's much much better than the actual Connect Four because you've got this base bit here and a place to put your counters, and you didn't have on the official game. Mm -hmm. So this is better. Right, Esme, you ready to go? Yeah. Go. Jace, Wait, you're so on my concerned. side. Who's going first? I'm going to let you because it's your game. Oh, I'm just such a good mum. Jace. Boxing day birthday. Boxing day? <laughs> Does any other, anybody else's child have a boxing day? Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> little man! <laughs> I just saw it happening on me. He went like this. He oh, like this. my. You just brought up that whole feed that I just gave you. Nice one, Jay sing him. Nice one. Someone's not in the best of moods. <laughs> Look how chunky these legs are getting. Look at these little boy. He's just been rolling over. I say rolling over, I don't actually mean rolling, I just mean like going to his front but with that arm stuck underneath him, so he has to roll back. <laughs> ah, you're giving Isla some love. Guess what, Daddy's on his way home. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Who? This is noise when he doesn't know if to laugh or cry. So it kind of comes out as a hmm. <laughs> Jace, what's this? Hello, Jace. Hello. Oh, my sisters have gone upstairs to play and I'm all by myself. All by and yes, I have dangled a toy from there. <laughs> oh, Daddy's home! <gasps> What's this? <gasps> What's this? Oh, come here. I made you some dinner, because I'm a good wife. Weren't sure if you'd have eaten or not. I so far, we'll make Daddy some too. I just ate some salad and then a oh, chocolate bar. Oh, give over. Did, did you vlog did. it? Mm, mm, no, didn't happen so. then. Didn't happen. No, I had a tuna salad. It didn't happen uh, unless, unless it's vlogged. And then I had a kin bueno at seven because I had the shakes badly. <laughs> Hello, darling. <laughs> Hello, gorgeous boy. I know I'm sweaty and I look a mess, but that's just me. You look sunburned. <laughs> and within two seconds of hearing Daddy's home, they're all back down. That's really cool, Les. I didn't know it made a noise, Esme. I know, I, I, I just realised that as well. Is that what you girls just unboxed? Yeah. Yeah, I actually took ages because I had to see loads of stickers on it. Oh, that's the best part, setting it all up with all the stickers. Oh! Turfles out. Cute! Pretty Medical centre! <laughs> <laughs> this also comes down here, Mum. That looks really cool. So, it comes with a nurse bag, a first day kit with like loads Cute. of like stuff to help. A nurse. A nurse doll. And then, they look cool. this is really cool. And then the, 
Yes, there's an S connector. And that's bad. And then it's a balloon. Yeah. A little tire centre. Comes with pretty much. Oh, JC's up and looking. That looks cool. And then you can check you in with the little checkboard. And then you can come up here. And you can use crutches. You can use all your other barbers as patients. Yeah. And it has crutches here for barbers. Awesome. I love it. It's awesome. Anyway, super cool noise. I'm going to leave these two to catch up on some man time. And I am going to go upstairs and give Esme actually a gift that one of you guys sent for her. It came in the post. And she asked me, she didn't want to open it when it arrived. I've gone really dark. But asked me if I would add it to her present pile on her birthday morning. But I actually forgot to. So I'm going to take it upstairs. She can open it now. Esme! Hello. What are you playing? Hey. Hey. <laughs> I love how you've done this, Esme. Esme removed the toy boxes. We had a few spare anyway, what had no boxes in. But she's made little homes. It looks so cute. And these two are the mummies. Who needs a doll's house, right? I don't know. Who needs a doll house? Just buy one of these yeah. from Ikea. Ikea. They're the best. But... Oh, yeah! <laughs> forgot to open that. We forgot to open it, didn't we? I yeah. forgot to put it on your pile. So, I've been waiting. Since I just I... explained. Yeah, last week to open this. Yeah. Well, not last week. Oh, a few days ago. <laughs> a few days ago. You asked me to put it on your pile, didn't you? And I forgot. And the to do with Barbie. I love... It's something to do with Barbie. Wow. <laughs> oh That's what you said it looks like me. Oh, she's got ginger hair too. Oh, she's so cute. She is really, really pretty. What do you say to our iPhone? Who thank you so who much. Who else that sent you that? Oh Big massive thank so you. Yeah, they I'm are. I'm going to put her in the house right now. She can be like the teenager. You're very lucky girl, Esme. Thank you. You're a very lucky girl. Yes, Isabel. I'm going to say something because in the store we saw that like a similar daughter in the same yeah. dress. But they didn't have a ginger hair on and that's so cool. And now they do. Yay. And now you've got a little ginger hair on. But it is time for bed. I'm afraid. We've been playing for like two hours. Literally. I know, you have been up here all and night. And I tidied it all up for my tents. Oh, the iPhone don't even know, Mummy. I know. Do you know how I know you've been playing up here all night? Because I've been lonely. Mummy's oh, so oh, lonely. Mommy. You've got pretty and oh. Jason. <laughs> oh, thanks, Isabel. I've got all these children and none of them coming. Oh, Thank you, Isla. I played with you for a bit. You did come and play with me for a little bit. We played Connect Four for like two rounds. Mummy! <laughs> oh, thanks. Oh, it's the first time it's making oh, thanks. Oh. <laughs> at least Jace. <laughs> at least at least Jace sits and Mommy. pees on me and six on me and yeah, you could have let us know. <laughs> okay, girlies, it's time to get ready for bed. So we're going to say good night. Good night. Who wants to say good night tonight? Not me. Okay, not Isla. Me. Esme. Me please. <laughs> okay, so Esme is going to end the vlog again tonight. Daddy. Was you just picking your nose? <laughs> Joking. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like. <laughs> anyway, guys, Esme's got a really, really exciting weekend planned this I've weekend. Got again She's got it. her. It's just a. It's just a bit of colour. Don't worry. She's got a really cool party tomorrow, which she's very excited about, aren't you? So come back tomorrow and watch what Esme gets up to for her tenth birthday. You just ruined it, mummy. I was gonna ask if it was somebody else's birthday or if it was my birthday party. Well, they know it's not someone else's when it was your birthday tomorrow. So yeah. somebody else's. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm tired. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you back here tomorrow at 5 p.m. 5 p.m. <laughs> Five Good p.m. Good night. night.